In Syracuse in 287 BCE, a young Archimedes is watching farmers struggle to irrigate their fields. Water flows downhill naturally, but how do you make it flow upward? Then Archimedes has an idea so simple, so brilliant, that it's still changing the world 2,300 years later. This is the story of how the Archimedes screw went from moving water uphill to launching rockets into space. So Archimedes was studying in Alexandria, Egypt, where he saw farmers desperately trying to lift water from the Nile River to their crops. They were using buckets, water wheels, and back-breaking manual labor, but none of it was very efficient. Then Archimedes invented his screw, a simple spiral blade inside a cylinder. Turn the handle and water gets trapped in the spiral chambers and carried upward. It was like a liquid staircase that could lift water to any height. The device was so effective that it spread across the ancient world. Romans used Archimedes screws to drain mines, fill aqueducts, and power fountains. But the real genius wasn't just moving water, it was the principle behind it. And then engineers realized you could reverse the process. Instead of using rotational motion to lift water, you could use falling water to create rotational motion. This became the foundation for water mills, windmills, and eventually steam engines. But the screw principle kept evolving. In the 1500s, Leonardo da Vinci designed flying machines based on aerial screws, basically giant corkscrews that would pull aircraft through the air. His designs didn't work, but the concept was sound. Then, in 1903, the Wright brothers achieved powered flight using propellers, which are just Archimedes screws spinning through air instead of water. Their airplane literally pulled itself through the sky using 2,000-year-old physics. But that was just the beginning. Modern helicopters use rotor blades based on screw principles. Ship propellers push vessels through water using the same spiral motion Archimedes invented. And then the screw principle helped us conquer the skies. Every airplane today uses propellers or jet engines with spinning compressor blades, all based on that same spiral motion that moves fluids efficiently. Today, Archimedes screws are still irrigating farms, just like they did in ancient Egypt. But they're also powering hydroelectric plants, processing sewage, generating renewable energy from low-flow rivers, and even moving materials in modern factories. From ancient irrigation to modern wind turbines, the simple spiral that Archimedes invented to lift water has become one of humanity's most versatile tools. Sometimes the most enduring innovations are the ones that work with nature's forces rather than against them. Thanks for watching. I'm Michael. Follow me here at Hoodie History for more incredible stories from the past.